Hey, what up guys? Welcome to the next installment of Road to Killing Games Season 4, Episode 6. So, let me show you guys the deck list for this episode. As you can tell, I'm using the 3 star Demotion deck. Um, if you guys haven't seen my other version of this deck, um, check it out. I'll link it to those videos. So basically, um, I added Guardian Joe because of its her effect. Basically, if you destroy your opponent monster, you gain attack life points to the original attack rate. So I could heal my life point up and reuse the 3 star Demotion again, right? So this is definitely a good card in the stack. I'm also running Bear Dragon like before. This is definitely a good card because of its effect, right? Basically, you toss three times and at least two heads, you get to destroy your opponent monster, right? It's definitely a good effect. I'm also running Sangamathon. This is such a good card in this deck. Um, if your opponent blindly attacking to this face down, they take damage, right? Because of this effect. Um, basically, what it does is um, it makes their attack to zero, right? So they take the damage. I have an instance where my opponent attacked into it and he got KO. Yeah? I'll show you guys that footage. It's so funny, yeah. I'm also running Supremacy Berry, pretty, pretty standard 3 star demotion deck. You want to use it to heal it up, right? Occasionally, um, my lap point would be higher than my opponent, right? So I won't be able to use it. And plus, um, occasionally, my lap point would be also the same lap point as my opponent. So that's why having um, the other healing card, the Kato, is also definitely good in this deck. I'm also running uh, Double Summon for that one turn. Kill potential. Preferably you want to have three, right? But I want to have two since I'm a free to player. I have to spend zero money in this game. So I, this is the only cards um, I was able to get multiple copies of. I'm also running a storm. This will um, help me get rid of the back open back row. Destroying your opponent back row is so good in this game because um it is so devastating when you destroy your opponent back row, right? I'm also running uh, Eliminating the League. This is definitely a good card. Basically, this card one spell card. You get to destroy your opponent monster that they control. So this is definitely a good card. I'm also running two Dimension Gate. This is to counter Relinquish, um, or the Charge, Econ Take, um, Clown Dex, and um, So Exchange, right? This is definitely a good card to counter those decks. Um, Throughout my climb, um, I don't see much of this card in play because um, I don't see much of a relinquish deck, right? And great keepers as well. So I don't use this card that much, but when it does, um, it, it is definitely a good card. You can also use it as a storm fodder for your storm, right? So even if you don't use it, you can use it as storm fodder. So yeah, this is pretty much a deck. This um, this is definitely a cons very consistent deck to get to keep. Platinum, so definitely worth checking. So uh, basically, the meta right now is Harpies and Two Star Demotion, right? So th plus, this is a free-to-play heavy friendly deck, so any free-to-play can make this deck. This is why I'm using it since I'm a free-to-play, right? So uh, I'm limited to decks that I can make, right? So this is why I'm using this deck. Plus, this deck is so much fun, yeah. So let me show you guys some um, couple of footage that I gather using this deck, like. Two, two of the matches is pretty hilarious so like I won't tell you what happened but you should probably already guess what happened so let me show you guys two matches um so the first match is against um Rax Raptor it's pretty hilarious so basically um I believe he yeah he, so he's using a Rex Raptor right at first I thought he was using the Dinosaur Kingdom, since that's pretty common, right? When you're using a Rex Raptor, but I was wrong, right? He's using Titan Showdown. I forgot what Titan Showdown does. Something about that point is lower than your opponent. They take the double damage or something like that, right? Here he sat down and he didn't set any monster, right? Here I knew that I was assuming that card is Golden Apple, right? You don't just set one card and don't summon any monster, like. It's pretty obvious it's a golden apple, right? You don't do that, yo. You don't set a card and don't summon any monster, right? So I was assuming that was golden apples, so I didn't attack into it. I summon my bear dragon. I set my intermediate transport here. I'm using trans transporter instead of dimension gate. I was setting it, it out, but I went back to dimension gate instead because this card, because my opponent can still attack my lap directly, right? So it's not that good. 
So I didn't attack with this life point, it's pretty obvious. Here, I summoned my Gonjo, attack with my Lois, and I went, I, he took 5,200 life points, that was pretty hilarious, so. Like, Titan showdown, got him KO, yo. It's pretty hilarious, sir. The next match is against Paradox Brothers. It's pretty much a mirror match. So, against mirror match, it's pretty much whoever get the get open hand wins, right? So I'm going first. You open up a Sangha Thunder. I use the start the motion. Send my Sangha Thunder. He won't be able to get over it. Plus, I could trigger his effect, right? I was debating whether I should activate Supreme Missile Bay, but I decided not to because I want to use that Storm Fodder. Here, he used some, but he didn't get two hats, so good game. Here, he decided to attack to my Sangha Thunder blindly, right? And I triggered my effect, and good game. That's all she wrote. Oh, that was pretty funny, yeah. He wasn't expecting that. So that was one of the plays you can make with Sangha Thunder. So these are some of the replays that I saved. So yeah, let me show you guys the live footage using the stack. So uh, using the stack, I managed to get to Platinum 3, right? It's pretty consistent. So you, guys should, you guys should definitely try this stack out. It's definitely a fun deck. So yeah, as you can tell, to this last day to get to KM game, right? So hopefully I can get to Kim again in this episode. If I don't get to Kim again in this episode, I'll try to play off screen and record those five win streak matches and save it and show you guys in my next video. That's what I'm gonna do. Fortunately, hopefully we can get in this episode. Maybe. Okay, let's go straight to the duel. So, let's do this. So, the game. Five win streak is gonna be like what 30 minutes long so i, I want to keep this video under 20 minutes right because like the screen record i'm using it can't record longer than 23 minutes right so here you'll be facing paradox brothers 23 cards interesting 24 actually here we're going second let's see what kind of deck this guy's running there's like variant of um Paradox deck where there's Dark Magician, there's um machine variants. Here he didn't set any um back row, so I'm gonna set this. Hmm. So we didn't open up with a monster, right? So we can't use some um, double summon. So that's unfortunate, so we can't utilize that. Here I'm gonna Activate three side emotion. Summon our coin draw. We're gonna attack with this monster and heal us up. If that mo if that card is um was a sang of thunder, yo, it'd be funny, yo. It'd be like like the, the video that to show you previous footage. Hopefully, it's not sang of thunder. Or it's not sang of thunder because he didn't use three star, right? What am I talking about, yo? So that if he if that happened to be Sang with Thunder, that'd be funny, yeah. But it's not right since he didn't use three star emotion. Good. So we hit it all up, so that means we won't get KO by Econ Take. So one of the weakness for this deck is um, Econ Take, right? Since we don't have any back row support. So this guy's using the um, Dark Magician variant, right? Hmm. Freaking fire alarm, yeah. My bad, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna s activate this. Summon bear dragon. Sorry about the fire alarm. They're doing some testing here. Yeah. Come on, yeah. Give me two heads. Nope. Well, I'm gonna attack with this. Hopefully that's not Sangha, but who runs Sangha and Dark Magician deck, right? Okay, here's Karibo, yo. Yeah. 
Okay, don't tell me you have second Krivo. Wow. Who the hell run this car, yo? Neo Akumador? 3000 defense, uh? Damn, yo. Well, luckily we have a um, bear dragon. We could get to the spec and destroy it. Wow, this guy's actually running reload as well. What kind of... This guy's running such a random car, it's a... This is such a pretty interesting. So sorry about the fire alarm, yeah. We're doing some testing right now. Okay. Attack. Hmm. Should I destroy his back row? Yeah, I should destroy his back row. He can do econ play, right? Cause um wait, wait, can you do this? Let me see if you could do this play. I never tried this play before, like If you use Dementia Gate, can you use the attack again? Let me see. Uh, I never tried this method before. Okay. Okay. Um. Let me see if this works. I never tried this method before. What was that? Interesting. That was a bluff, yeah. Can you use a better game? Oh, sweet, yo. I never knew you could do the uh, effect again. That's pretty insane, yo. So you guys learned something, yo. You could use the matching gate to activate this effect again, yo. I've seen um Decay. He used Y20 on the matching gate, right? If you have any control, good game. So I was saying, um, I've seen DK uses um Y20 on the matching gate to attack twice with Gaia, right? That was pretty interesting. I'm not sure if, if you could use Dimension Gate on Sanger of the Thunder. Would it would this effect be reusable again if you use Dimension Gate on Sanger of Thunder? I never tried before. It probably might work here. Yeah. Here yeah, we don't have um, enough life point to summon out monster, right? So uh, at this point we know that he had two Dark Magician in his deck. I mean in his hand, right? Because we destroyed two Blue Dragon Summoner. So he had two Dark Magician. And plus his life point is 2000 so he can't summon a high level monster unless if you have um supremacy berry right he pretty much starting at this point yeah so he was running on was it reload and um that 3000 defense or like such a random card, so I, I never seen Paradox run those cards. So finally, yeah, this guy decided to quit instead of wasting our time. So, yeah, I learned a new thing, yo. You can use Dimension Gate to use um, the fact of uh, Twin Bear Dragon again. That's pretty nice, though. Tell me if you could use some Sangam Thunder effect again using Dimension Gate. Um, it say once. Purdue only, right? That's what I read in the in description. So we want, so we need to make four more, yeah. Let's do this, yeah. So yeah, I can't record longer than 23 minutes, um, because of the screen record I'm using. So if this video get cut off at the end, I apologize. Okay, we're facing Mewo. This is a pretty good matchup since we have um. 
permissive to hear your eyes up. Okay. He put in two. I'm gonna activate this. Set a defense mode. So this guy's quit, yeah. Oh, he's not quitting. Interesting. I can miss the permissive berry. I'm going to set it so he can do Econ Take or Massive Curse. Seem pretty good, yeah. Wow, another Fire Line, yeah. This is crazy, man. I swear, I thought Fire Line, like, the Fire Line was, they was doing inspection since this morning, yeah. Hmm. I'm not gonna activate um do start the motion because we have double summon right so we want to take advantage of double summon so I'm gonna wait a turn till we draw another monster card so yeah that's what I'm gonna do I'm gonna flip summon attacking this monster hopefully it's not a Yomi ship Get our HP up. What does this card do? Uh, when this card is a by Santa Guard. Interesting. He's actually helping us. Though. We can't, wait, we can't tribute? This card cannot be a tribute. Wow. But I could banish it, right? Yeah, I could banish it with Dimension Gaia so I could get rid of it. Hmm. Wow. Kay. Can't. He only um. Uh, so that I'm guessing he have summoned up to two neighbor monsters. Why didn't he summon two, yo? If he have done that, then my monster will be locked. Right? I'm, I'm guessing he draw three of them. I mean, he draw two of them in the sand. So I'm guessing that one card in the sand is um, Masubi, Mas right? Here, I don't know what I'm gonna do here. Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna activate this. I'm gonna tribute summon, yeah. Wow. Sky man. I forgot you can tribute summon when you use some um, three star demotion, right? Luckily our monster is filled up right, so we can't do anything. But he have any control here. Wow. Look at that HP, uh, 100. Luckily, we would have taken that 1000 hit to a good game. Hmm. Wow, I made a mistake here. I should have used Dimension Gate on my Guardian Angel and sent out Guardian Angel, right? That was my mistake. I should have done that, yeah. Wow. Okay, that was a bluff. That, that's that trap or was a bluff. So yeah, that misplay didn't cost that, yeah. We should have used Dimension Gate to banish one of our monsters and use Double Summon to summon our other Guardian Angel, right? That was my mistake. So we want two in a row now. Since this is the last day till we can get the Kim games, till the rank reset, right? So mostly all the good decks are already in Kim games, right? So the competition is not that 
much, right? But still, it's, it's very hard task to get to King Games still, nevertheless. Paradox Bros. Okay, this is our third match. Okay, double summon sweet. Hopefully, um, we can join into a bear dragon here. Is he running Dark Magician variant? Ooh. Does he have double summon? Super Mr. Very interesting. I'm guessing that back row is some um, enemy controller. I don't think they run on um, mirror wall. Okay, I'm gonna activate this. Now both our light point is now I'm gonna act. Now I'm gonna wait. Let's see if it's mirror wall. If there's any delay. Nope. So it's not mirror wall. Summon Garden Angel. Okay, there's no delays. It's probably bluff. Summon this. Attack with this so I could hear a light print. Okay, that was a bluff. 2400 yards. Sweet. Does he have Supreme Mr. Berry? It's gonna be hard for him to come back from this, though. Look at our life points, yeah, 6,400. Yep. So this is out there, match, yeah. Two more to go, yeah. Can we do this? Yo, hopefully the video doesn't get cut off, yo. I be mean, cheese, man. But the matches are going really quick, right? So that's good. I'm not a mere matches, so. though. We've seen a lot of Paradox Brothers, though. Ooh, double summon. This is why I love having double summon, yo. For the one-tier king potential. I want to run three double summon, but I want to two, right? So I might open more of those uh, compliance pack to get the third one. Wait, is this the same guy? Are we facing the same guy? This is like a exactly um, it feels exactly the same as last video, yeah. Okay, this, this guy definitely have um dimension gear, yeah. So I'm gonna activate do side motion. Summon Guardian Joe. He definitely have Dimension Gate. Cause there's like so many delay, yo. Activate Super Mr. Berry. Activate Double Summon. It'd be, it'd be pretty hilarious if we're facing the same guy. It's pretty much like exactly duplicate of that match, yeah. We open him a double summon and the same monster, same exact. It's like deja vu, yeah. Attack. I'm probably gonna save this video just in case. Um. What the hell? This is gonna be special when this guy is gonna draw more card. Oh, only one card? Wow, it's, it's crazy. I wasn't expecting that. I thought that card destroyed all the monsters on the field except fire. Maybe I'm wrong. You can't take? Oh. No heads and no heads. Yes. The only way he... Is he gonna go suicide? Okay, activate this. That's a bluff. Is it a bluff? Oh. 
My suicide is... He had no cards in left in his hand. Okay. Okay, I win you. Oops, I forgot to save it. Wow, this guy's talking about the fire alarm, yeah? Finally, yeah. Okay, this is the last match, the promotion match. Yeah. This will hopefully get us to Kim Games, though. Come on, come on, come on. Yo, I'm, I'm so hyped, yeah. Yo, I'd be cheesy if this video got cut off, yeah. Hey guys, the reason I'm making this video is because the last match got cut off. Which I want to say, like, I'd be cheesy if the video got cut off and the video got cut off, yeah. What's the chance of that happening? So anyway, i show you guys the mat the last match. So this match will get me to Kim Games if I win, right? This is the fifth match. I won't tell you what happened, but you should already know because it's based on the title. So yeah, spoilers, um, I lost. So we're facing Joy Wheeler, right? We're using Paradox Brothers. So we went second, I believe. Yep, let's see. We're facing um, Red Eyes Black Dragon deck. He went off with the card of the redstone, basically he discard one right from his hand and from his deck, right? Yeah, I use a three star demotion, summon bear dragon, set down uses his effect to distress monster. Luckily we got two heads. Yeah, he uses his blue dragon summon effect to get out his red eyes from his deck. Here yeah, as to use Supreme Bay to hear one left hand backup, I set Lemon and Lee and the matching gate and my turn. Go for the attack. Here he used his second card of the redstone and ditch his red eyes. Here he set three cards. And here I use his bear dragon attack again. Luckily he got two heads. But unfortunately I destroyed his um Vanguard. So he get to special summon um his red eyes from his deck right because of the Vanguard pack. But it doesn't really matter because um, our bear dragon has higher attack than his red eyes black dragon, right? So we don't have to worry about it. He has three set cards, so I'm guessing two of them is red eyes spirits and one of them is champion vigilance. So I used element elite to bait out his champion vigilance. That's what it did. He uses his champion vigilance. I went for the attack. Fortunately, he doesn't have any. Mirror wall or any damage step card. Here, um, he uses last gamble in row three, right? He uses red eye spirit, special summon his second red eyes. Says my monster. Here he attacked into my monster. I'm guessing he have a um, damage step card, but nope, he have enemy controller. He switched the position of my monster so he could get over it. But luckily, I have dimension gate. To banish my monster, so stop him from destroying my monster, right? But we take damage anyway. I'm not sure what that back card is, but I'm guessing it's um champion vigilance, right? So I was trying to bait out his champion vigilance by using storm, and that's what I did. I used storm, bait out his champion vigilance. So he uses sec second champion vigilance. So we can't do anything at this point. So I end our turn. Here, I'm just waiting for a second storm at this point. He's down to two cards, so I, I was hoping I could he could deck out so I could get a win. Here, I draw into um, second storm. I was debating whether if I should storm right now to destroy his back or right. But I decided not to because um, I was worried about his um, enemy controller, right? So, and plus um, his set card could be champion vengeance so it would pretty much negate my storm right so i decided not to use storm and hope that he decked out so if we could get the win that's what i did i am a turn now he's down to one card here he flips some of all his monsters so i'm guessing he joined to um 
mail wall or something that could stop my attack right so here like I was in the top position right I have no way to come back from this since um we don't have any backward support and if he have trying to the card I was saying like mail wall or enemy control we would have lost right so here he end his turn I'm guessing because um he can activate the second turn right so he's waiting for a turn so here I made a mistake um I should have storm here but I decided not to because um I was hoping that he would deck out so this was my mistake right I would have I should have definitely storm his back row or clear his back row right here I'm a at my turn I didn't storm here I bring back my monster in the pen position either way um doesn't matter what position I'm since they're rising energy right so either way we're gonna lose right so yeah final game we lost so we're gonna get the kill games how unfortunate so yeah that miss pick probably cost us be like if we would have storm our dimension gate and clear his back row we would have probably won the match I'm not sure because um what if he have any controller or champion vigilance right if, we, if he have champion vigilance then either way we lost right so that was a pretty intense match um so we didn't we couldn't get the uh, two king games in this episode pretty unfortunate oh, but I guess um bad luck I guess so yeah um I'm gonna end the video here um I'm not sure if I could get camera games by the season because um the season is, is almost ending right so and I don't feel like grinding again I'm not sure yet we'll see so yeah if you guys enjoyed this video um give it a thumbs up um I try to bring more content like this in the future if you guys want to see similar videos like this subscribe so yeah until then, later.